Mr. Speaker, 19,000 and counting. That's the number of people with confirmed cases of Zika in America so far. 1,800 and counting. The number of pregnant women in the U.S. with confirmed cases of Zika so far. 17 and counting. The number of babies born with birth defects related to the Zika virus so far. Six months and counting. And that's how long ago President Obama asked Congress to do its job and provide supplemental funding to combat the virus. Mr. Speaker, how many more Americans must suffer before the House Republicans realize that the health of our families matters more than politics? How many more pregnant women must receive the devastating news that they've contracted the virus before the GOP leadership stops playing games with American lives? Instead of heeding the pleas, uh, the pleas of the CDC, public health experts, and the medical community, House Republicans revealed their true priorities when they decided to hold Zika funding hostage over women's health care and the Confederate flag. That's just wrong, Mr. Speaker. Let's protect pregnant women. Let's save vulnerable infants. Let's pass a clean Zika funding bill. Thank you. I yield back. The time of the